Election season could turn out to be a record breaker. Four days into early voting here in North Carolina, some lines are still long and enthusiasm could turn to frustration as you wait. News Channel 36 reporter Mario Don finds out what Mecklenburg County has done to accommodate more early voters in this Decision 2008 report. Any day of the week, you have 20 early voting sites to choose from in Mecklenburg County. In the first three days of early voting, some locations have had shorter lines than others, like the one here at the CPCC North Campus in Huntersville. Well, I have my stopwatch out. I'm going to find out how long it takes for me to vote. Keep in mind that currently, the wait time at most early voting locations runs about one hour. Well, I voted, and it took me less than 13 minutes to cast a ballot. In all, Mecklenburg County election officials tell me that they've stepped up efforts when it comes to early voting to make it easier for you to vote. I think every site's been, been busy, busy, busy. To make room for at least 150,000 early voters, Mecklenburg County added eight more polling locations. Uh, last uh, presidential election, I don't think we had 12 sites. In the past, only few early voting sites opened on Sunday. This year, we've got all 20 sites open Saturday and Sunday. More voting machines, more election workers, more hours than in 2004. Right, four years ago, we opened all of them uh, on, the, on Saturday from 10 to 1. This year, we're opening the, this coming Saturday from 10 to 5. A first-time early voter likes what she sees. We had like one person ahead of me, so I had absolutely no problem voting. Uh, make sure that you take a look at the sample ballot. If you review the sample ballot while in line, it could speed up the process when you get to the voting machine. Any voter that we take care of before Election Day is a voter we don't have to worry about. Mario Roldan, News Channel 36.